Hi guys, I'm here with a really good new product. Um, it's the Wee Dad Curl Conditioning Wash. It's the Curl Co-Wash Low Foam Cleansing Conditioner. Sulfate free for all textures. I received this uh, from Wee Dad directly, so I didn't buy this myself. They had contacted me and asked me if I'd be interested in doing a review on it. So, of course, it's for curly hair. It's from Wee Dad. I said, of course, why not? I'm always interested in trying new curl products. Uh, normally, you guys know I'm always trying out new uh, hair care products, especially anything for curly hair, so I decided to give this a go. Um, it smells really good. Um, it smells like it smells like an amber florally type of scent, like something you pick up uh, as an actual scent in Bath and Body Works or Victoria's Secrets. The consistency is creamy and it's thick. As you can see, it's not running anywhere or going anywhere. And I used this twice already so far. The first time I used it, I used it on uh, hair that was already straightened and it was fourth day hair. So I used it then and I really liked it. Uh, then I used it again the next day when my hair was, you know, back to curly. And I wanted to give this a fair run, so normally I put a few different products in my hair to make it curly. Uh, all I used today was this We Dead Curl Co-Wash and my normal gel that I use. I haven't put in any frizz products in my hair or anti-frizz products in my hair. Um, and as you can see, the curls are very soft. They're not crunchy. They're extremely curly. And there's no frizz. So I am very impressed by that, that a conditioning, uh, low foam conditioner wash can actually, you know, stop the frizz in your hair without having to apply a ton of products. And it is very soft, and the smell carries in your hair. Like when I woke up this morning, I still smelt it, and then I washed my hair again. Um, I did find it did work better. Um, on my curly hair rather than it's straightened because when it's straightened it's been that way for a couple of days um, but it did work better today when I used it when my hair was already curly and it was only uh, the next day um, and it has a very good slip I forgot to mention that um, it combs right through knots uh, even with the uh, fourth day hair I got through the knots in my hair um, if your hair is really, really knotty, you might have to work out a little bit, but for the most part, it has enough slip to get through the knot, so don't worry about that either. Um, I'll read a little bit on the back what it says. Uh, Curl Co-Wash, a rich, low-lathering, sulfate-free cleansing conditioner that leaves hair moisturized, soft, and frizz-free while gently clearing hair of buildup. Unlike most cleansing conditioners, our thick, foamy texture is concentrated blend of conditioners and oils plus a dose of gentle, naturally derived coconut cleanser for a truly unique experience that never dries, strips, or strips hair. Black cumin seed oil and Jamaican black oil deeply condition strands with nourishing vitamins and minerals, taming, smoothing hair, and reducing frizz, which it definitely has done. Rosemary and sage oils gently refresh and balance the scalp while delivering shine to the hair, and just when use, tresses look and feel hydrated, soft, smooth, and full of life protects from dryness, breakage, and color fading. And my hair is very soft. It's extremely soft. And my hair feels clean. Um, a lot of times with different uh, conditioning washes, your hair feels weighed down or there's some kind of like weight to it. This feels weightless. It's very curly. It's very soft. Um, your scalp actually feels clean with this. A lot of the conditioning washes, you'll wash your hair, you'll wash your scalp, but your scalp never actually feels like it's clean. Um, some some of the other conditioning washes, like when they have the menthol in it, which I think the main reason that's in there is to give you that tingle to make you 
feel clean, but sometimes with the when, even though I do use it and I will continue to finish using what I have, um, it kind of leaves like a damp or like a thick feeling right in here. And this doesn't do that. This actually makes you feel like you've cleaned your scalp with a real shampoo um, without using any kind of harsh chemicals on it or anything like that. So that's really good. Um, this is a 16 ounce. It normally goes for $30. It is a little expensive, but I think it's definitely worth it if you have the money to splurge on it. I would definitely check it out whether your hair is wavy or curly. And to tell you the truth, this would even be excellent for a straight hair, I think. Um, what else can I tell you about this? Um, I'll tell you how to use it. This is basically how I used it. It says to saturate hair thoroughly with lukewarm water, divide into four sections, and apply three to eight pumps to each section. So I wet my hair, I sectioned it out here and here and then here and here. Um, originally, the first time I used it, I applied five pumps. And I don't think that was enough for my hair. So I did another 10 pumps just through the bottom legs. Um, now, if you're thinking that's a lot, it does sound like a lot, especially if you're used to when, because when has the big long pump, and every time you pump, you get a lot out. This has a tiny, short action pump, so when you're doing five pumps of this compared to five pumps of when, it's, it's totally different. This does not pump out that much product, so in essence, you're using less of this than you would, say, when. Um... So I ended up using the 5 pumps per section, so that's 20, and then I did another 10 pumps, so I used 30 pumps altogether. Uh, and I've used it twice, and you can see I really didn't, it didn't use a lot. Let me see if you can, if you see that. This was all the way full, and using it twice, I've only used that much of it. So, it is a lot, it sounds like a lot, but it's not when it comes to the amount of product that you're actually using. Um, it smells really good, I went over that. It, it's free of sulfate, silicones, and it has no parabens. It also has no menthol. I think that's important to state because one of the other leading conditioner washes does have menthol, and a lot of people have reactions to the menthol, whether it's... Uh, that on their scalp or their back, the menthol doesn't agree with them. I personally don't have any problems with it, but um, I think you guys should check this out. Uh, I don't know if they're offering samples of this yet. Uh, check Sephora. So a lot of times they get the uh, the mini samples. Um, I haven't seen it on there yet though either for the samples. Uh, it does say it's good for color treated hair, so that's good to know. It prevents color fading, or it protects from color fading. And uh, I'm pretty impressed by this. I have the whole listing. I'll put the whole listing of ingredients on the bottom. I also have a blog that I did, a blog post I did on this. If you want to check that out on my blog, on um, Blogspot, on Blogger. Um, it's made in the USA. There's no animal testing. So for any of you that that's important to, no animal testing and made in the USA. The bottle is recyclable, recyclable. It's a two, so that's uh, high density poly, high density polyethylene. So you can recycle this bottle. It's made out of the same kind of plastic that uh, high density uh, detergent soaps for your uh, laundry and stuff like that. It's made out of that kind of plastic. Um, that's about it. I mean, I love this. I've only used it twice, but I can tell I'm going to continue to use it. Uh, it hasn't dried my hair out. My scalp feels clean. The scent is great. It's like an amber, amber floral scent. There's no chemical smell to it, um, and it does stay in your hair. Uh, that's the only thing I would caution if you don't like strong scents. Not that it's a strong scent, but it is there, an amber. You can definitely tell it's an amber uh musky, florally type of scent, um, and the scent will stay in your hair. I woke up this morning, and it was there. It was just as strong as it was the day before, 
So that's one thing. If you don't like a lot of scents to your products, then maybe you won't like this. Uh, but for me, it's great. And uh, I was checking out their website, and I saw they had some new products, uh, Salon Series products, and I definitely want to check them out. Um, but I thank Wee Dad for sending this to me. Uh, and I'm glad I had the chance to review it. And I think you guys should check it out, especially if you have curly hair. And it, it does really keep the frizz out. And like I said, all I put in my hair today was my normal gel that I use. I hadn't, I didn't use Curl Keeper. I didn't use any kind of anti-frizz products or anything on my hair that I've shown you in past videos. And I really like it. So thanks guys for sending this to me. I appreciate it very much. And I'm glad I got to try it out. If you have any questions, just post them down below. And I will try and get back to you as soon as possible. Um, but yeah, I'm going to continue to use this. And if I have any other thoughts or anything, I will update you on my blog. So make sure to check that out as well. And I will talk to you guys soon. See you later. Bye.